to whom praise are due forever. We, the lost found nation of Islam here in the wilderness of South America, can never give enough thanks and praise to Allah for raising up from among us his last and greatest messenger, the most honorable Elijah Muhammad. Yes, sir. I greet you, my brothers and sisters, with the greetings of peace and paradise. Salaamu Alaikum. Alaikum Salaam, sir. We're happy to see each and every one of you here today. It turned out to be a beautiful day. The way it was raining last night, the thunders and lightning. I know some of you said, say, well, uh, just keep up, I ain't going to the temple of Mark. <laughs> but uh, we have to understand that we are living in the last days of this evil and wicked world. And chastisements are hitting America day and night. Yes, sir. If you look at the news, you would see that from Texas, Dallas, all the way to Chicago, tornado watches. Mm -hmm. huh? yes, sir. Yes, sir. So people, black people, mm -hmm. our beloved brothers and sisters, don't realize the time that we're living in. The Holy Quran has taught against spoke and play. Is that right? And this is what we see our young people into today spoke and play. Huh? Things of destruction. See, well, football player blew himself away. Yes, Junior say yes, mm -hmm. yeah. And I said that this is about the third or fourth that shot themselves in the in the stomach. Mm -hmm. yes, sir. Committed suicide. Yes, sir. You know. Mm -hmm. But it has a toll on our people. There are many who are crumpled. They cannot play because they can't stand. The knees and everything. But there are many uh, reasons why the Armelage um, Muhammad has taught us against sport and play. Yes, sir. Uh, that's not going to get us into the year. Uh, although it's much money in it, but we, the followers of the Armelage um, Muhammad, never see any of it. You don't hear of these black millionaire basketball, football players, or hockey players donate anything to the nation of Islam. That's right. Exactly. Mm -hmm. This evil and wicked way of life is where the money goes that black people are making. That's right. Huh? That's right. None of them come forth and say, I want to help my people to learn the truth about themselves. How many of you got thousands of black millionaire football and basketball players? Yes, sir. Thousands of them. Think what would happen if each one put one of those millions that they have. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Just pull it together. Look where we would be if they did it under the direction of the teachings of the Honorable Elijah Muhammad. Yes, sir. That's right. That's right. Yes, sir. They'll do it for churches. Right. right. But we have to understand Christianity is not the religion of the black man and black woman. That's right. Christianity is the religion of the devil. Yes, sir. Our people have been so brainwashed over 400 years, they believe that the devil's religion is their religion. Yes, sir. For 400 years they have had Christianity. Yes, sir. But only 100 years have the black man had Christianity. 
How can a black person in America today stand and say, I'm an intelligent black man, a woman, and believe in this religion, the slave master's religion? Huh? If it wasn't good for you in 400 years, why would it be good for you today? We have to think about this. Yes, sir. If you're worshiping a God today that the slave master have had yes, sir. all of his life, for 400 years, all the torture, murder, raping, mm -hmm. denying justice, right, right. freedom to the black man and woman, all of a sudden, that same God going to turn around and say, I'm going to give it to these slaves. Huh? Where in the Bible do you find anything like that? Mm -hmm. The people that was in bondage to Nebuchadnezzar and Balthazar under Daniel's leadership. Daniel never told the people to worship Baal. Yes, Is that right? Yes, yes, they said the Hebrew children were thrown into the fiery punish. Because they wouldn't bow to bail. Right. Huh? Now people sit in church and sing and hoop and holler and shout about the Hebrew children. Mm -hmm. huh? Daniel was thrown into the lion's den. Yes, huh? But look at Daniel, who the Honorable Elijah Muhammad is a representative of Daniel's life. Yes, Yes, sir. Daniel was thrown into the lion's den. Mm -hmm. Young Elijah Muhammad was thrown into the lion's den. Yes, sir. He was thrown into the prisons. Yes, the doors sir. were locked on him. Yes, but he walked out untouched. That's right. That's right. Is that right? Yes, That's sir. right. Just as Daniel walked out. <laughs> Moses and the people in bondage in Egypt. They realized when Moses came, it was time for them to take a good long look yes. at Pharaoh That's right. and the God of Pharaoh. Mm -hmm. huh? right. Think about it. Yes, sir. Elijah Muhammad has taught us that Moses taught his people to give up Pharaoh's God. Do not worship Pharaoh or his God. Turn back to the God of your forefathers. You will never prosper and be respected under this flag. Believing in this religion. Even those that are in this religion and say, I believe. 100%. They don't get no respect from their enemies. No. They're just prison of preachers. Is that right? They burn black churches. Is that right? Here the churches are full on Sundays. And the white man see them full. But he still don't give them any respect. That's right. They spend their last dollar with the white man. Yes, sir. But he still don't give them any respect. Right. Huh? Think about that. Young Roger Mama said, turn to your own. Yes, sir. Build our own society. Build our own supermarkets. Yes, sir. Huh? Yes, sir. Feed ourselves and our children. From that which we produce. Yes, sir. The other right mama says it's time that we become producers yes, as well as consumers. Yes, then we would get respect. Yes, sir. Nobody respect a beggar. That's true. That's true. Is that right? That's right? Black man and black woman have to beg for everything that they get. Is that right? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. How can you say I'm an equal to the man I'm begging? Mm -hmm. 
you look like a fool. That's right. That's right. And everybody see you look like look at you like a fool. Because you are a fool. Yes, sir. When you're begging a man and sit in front of the man in the world and say, I'm an equal too. That's right. That's right. Lazarus wasn't an equal to uh, the rich man. That's true. Yes, sir. You see, Lazarus laid at the rich man's doorstep, begging him for the crumbs that came from his table. That's right. That's right. The rich man didn't respect Lazarus. That's right. Huh? Until the Lazarus was dead. And then he was raised up to God. And then the plagues began to hit the rich man. Yes, sir. And the rich man called to Lazarus God and said, Sit him down. <laughs> yes, sir. Sit him Lazarus down. I'm burning up. Let him put a drop of water on my parching tongue. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. We are the Lazarus today. Yes, sir. We've been begging for 400 years under this flag to the rich man. That's right. But now our Almighty God, Allah, came, raised up one from among us, and give us freedom just as an equality. Yes, sir. We're not begging at the foot of the white man any longer. That's right. Huh? That's right. We are not looking for a mystery God to solve, solve our problems. Is that right? We're looking for a living God. A God we can recognize. That's right. Not a God that we can't recognize. That's right. Huh? That's right. You say, well, my God is great. Jesus is great. My God is so great he can't be seen. That's right. mm. But we said that we have a God mm. yes, sir. that we can see. Oh, that's, that's right. right. We don't look for no mystery yes. to solve our problems. No, sir. Right. We're the children of God. And if we're the children of God, then God is going to solve our problems. That's right. That's right. That's right. Teach. Yes, sir. Problems are not solved by people that have no understanding. That's right. When you don't know your own name, nationality, religion of God, you got problems. That's right. huh? yes, you need someone to come and solve that problem. Yes, That's right. And if you got a problem, that means you need a teacher. Sure, sure. Right. When you go to school and they give you a problem, you don't know how to solve it. Sure, right. The preacher have to tell, the, uh, pardon me, the teacher have to tell you how to solve that problem. That's right, that's right. And then when the teacher tells you, if you're listening, then you know how to work out that problem. Yes, sir. That's right. And when the time comes for a test, Huh? You won't run to your enemy yes. to solve your problem. That's right. You would run to the one that God sent to solve your problem. Right. And it's time now for the black man to leave this and come over here. That's right. That's right. Teach. We have the solution to the problem. Yes, sir. Y'all don't like the moment haven't given us. The solution. Black people today do not even recognize those who call themselves Muslims. Remember what I said now. <laughs> those who call themselves Muslims. Yes, Speak on it. Yes, sir. You can call yourself John or Johnny, but your name might be James. Mm. But they called you that, which is not you. That's right. 
Muslims who said they are uh, true believers of Father Zahra Muhammad call themselves Muslims. Yes, sir. That's right. hmm? If you call yourself a Muslim, mm. if you have been given supreme wisdom, knowledge, and understanding, yes, sir. I say understanding. Yes, sir. <laughs> you can have supreme wisdom and knowledge, but if you don't have understanding, yes, you're a fool. That's right. That's right. Mm. How can you say, I got supreme wisdom, knowledge, and understanding, and run into a devil in Scientology and all that yes, sir. Mm. to study what that devil has to say? Yes, mm. sir. You're nothing but a fool. You're showing the world that you're a fool. Yes, sir. Not a I've given us knowledge supreme. Yes, sir. And we turn around and run to the devil and say, I got to take a course in the devil's religion. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Huh? Yes, sir. Mm. If that is true, it means you didn't take a course in your own religion. <laughs> if you did, you would have finished the course. Oh, <laughs> Teach. True. Running around there, putting on Facebook that you are uh, have passed the test mm -mm. in the study of Scientology. Mm -mm. I don't see you putting on there, I passed the test of our Muslim lessons. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Huh? I don't see you so proud that you're doing that. But you put on there and show your diploma that you have passed the test in Scientology. Yes, sir. That shows you that you're a bigger fool than the devil even thought you were. Yes, sir. <laughs> you have the religion of God and you go and study the religion of the devil. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. If you got the religion of God, you don't need to study the religion of the devil. No, sir. Because if you got the religion of God, you know who you are and who the devil is. That's right, that's and right. You Teach. Already going for Teach. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Mm. You don't have to go study the devil. Four hundred years we've been studying this devil. Yes, that's right. If you don't know this devil by now, give it up. <laughs> because you're going down with this devil. That's right, that's right. Teach. That's right. Teach. Teach. Take your time, sir.